What's up world, this is Sensei to Oz from ARAM Recording and Mastering. Today I'm going to be showing you how to use remote desktop to control your workstation from another computer. In this case today I'll be using the Surface Pro 4 um, for that demonstration. Now for some of you tech savvy people that have heard of remote desktop, you probably worked at jobs or corporations or worked in front of a computer in general. And if you had a problem with your system, you would call the help desk. From there, the help desk would assign an IT person to work on your computer. And if the IT person was not able to physically be in front of your computer, uh, they would use remote desktop to remotely log into your computer from another location to install software, make adjustments, or fix any issues that might be wrong with the system. Now, I've never seen anyone in my social circle use remote desktop in a recording studio situation. Not saying that, you know, there's that there isn't anyone out there that's doing it. I just haven't seen it. I got interested in that feature with Personas's uh Studio One remote. And, you know, cuz that that's that's just a helpful feature to have to, you know, be able to control your uh main workstation from anywhere. However, when I looked at the computer system requirements for you know, for that app, it said that it is for the Apple iPad. Now, that could be pretty discouraging if you run on a PC type of system like myself. But it can be done, and I'm going to show you today. Now, I currently have a session up right now. The song is called uh, Give Em More by Just Cause. And... I'm going to remotely control this session that is on my main workstation from the Surface Pro 4. What you're going to see is when I log into the system, it's going to move the desktop screen from this workstation right over to the Surface Pro 4, and then I'll be able to control that workstation right here from the Surface Pro 4. All right, so let's get started. Yeah. Oh. Uh. Just want to talk to you for a minute. Now I'm walking to the other side of the room. The session is being controlled by the Surface Pro 4 now. So I can stop the session. I can move the timeline, move the mixer, pull up plugins, anything that I would normally do sitting in front of the system I can do right now from anywhere in this room and possibly anywhere in this building. What I may do later on, I may pull up a, uh, do another video and I will be doing this not with Studio One, but I'll be showing you that you can also do this in Pro Tools as well. All right, I hope this video was helpful. I'm not the greatest at these kind of things, so just bear with me, but you take care.